Hi friends, it's Tiffany from Tiffany O Studio. I just wanted to come on here and make a quick video to say, well, first of all, Happy New Year. I'm really excited 2019's here and last year was an incredible year for me. It was the best year for my business. So I wanna say thank you so much because obviously I couldn't be doing this without you guys. So thanks so much. And I just kind of wanted to talk a little bit about some of my ideas for 2019 and my new Wild and Wonderful line. A lot of you got my email blast yesterday and now I'm making the video to kind of give you a little more detail about the products that are in the line. So like I said, in 2019, I'm going to have a few more goals. You're going to notice a few changes with my business. Um, and I'm going to try to do some more videos like we are doing today. Um, I noticed last year you guys really did like it when I did the videos. I got more views. It seemed like it was more engaging and I think that's great. So I would love to talk to you guys more. So that's why I'm here today. So let's dive right in. I don't want to take up your entire day. And I want to show you the five mugs that were in the Wild and Wonderful Camp Mug Collection that I just launched. So, a little background story about this collection. My husband Matt and I, we went on a vacation last September. I'm trying to get into the habit of a little more healthier lifestyle, a little better care of myself when I'm doing my business stuff. And I found that around September is a good time to take a little mini vacation, reboot, recharge, and get ready for the holidays. And that's exactly what we did. We went out west to Arizona. We spent an entire week in the desert and it was amazing. I can't wait. We literally were talking about how to buy a little house in Arizona because it's just a really cool area. It's a good launching pad for a lot of other adventures. It was awesome. So that's what inspired this line. So the camp mugs, you guys love these and I love these. I'm so excited you like them because I've been obsessed with these and I'm finally glad that it's starting to catch on. I know they're a pretty big trend right now and you proved it by your sales, my sales to you that you guys love these things. So I want to show you the details of these. Again, these are aluminum metal mugs. They don't break. They are, I mean, if you really want to break it, you probably could, but they're nice and hard, but they're lightweight as well. So they're really fun. They're dishwasher safe. Again, I want to reiterate, I don't do vinyl. I'm not using those machines. It's not a sticker. My process is called sublimation. I talk about that more in detail in other videos that you can go on my channel and look at. Um, but the long story short is it's pressed directly into the mug, making it dishwasher safe. But do not, do not put these in the microwave. I have to say it, I know it's silly, but don't do it. I get emails. I love you that you email me about it because just don't, do not put these in the microwave. So that's my disclaimer. Anyways, so these mugs, I did five different styles of designs. I use my photography and that's why I love this process. I can take my images and translate them into the vision I want. So I took a lot of the images, I paired it up with some fun graphics that a, art, a local artist created and I love it. So this is one where I took the picture is a picture of the sunrise in Jerome where we were um, staying the night there. It's a really cool old copper mining town, really neat. Woke up at super early, got some really fun sunrise pictures, and I thought this turned out really nice. This one says, I don't need therapy, I just need to go camping. I thought it was funny, I think it is really funny. And it is part of it, like I said before. Getting outside really helps clear my head. I love to hike, that's why I've gotten way more into landscape photography. I always have my camera with me, and this is the result. So it's a fun, sunrise picture it's a really pretty landscape photo and then the fun graphic that goes with it super cute love it so that's one of them this is the second one this has a picture of a train i know there's all kinds of train lovers out there my sister just took a train from ohio to vermont and actually i'm thinking about doing the same thing in a few months anyways so this train was actually the train at the grand canyon i took a really cool black and white photo well i turned it into black and white put the train on there and then a little phrase that says wilderness adventure is calling because it's pretty awesome it's 
Super fun metal camp mug with some photography and a really cute frame. Keep in mind, these aren't huge mugs. I believe they're about 10, 10 ounces. So they're smaller. They're great because they can throw it in your hiking backpack. I know I don't bring a huge bag with me. You could clip a carabiner to these and just have it dangle off of your bag because it's an aluminum mug. It'll work perfect, nice and lightweight. This one's my personal fav favorite. I love how the colors turned out. This image I actually took in Sedona. My favorite part of our trip was definitely Sedona. It's just this magical place with these red rocks. I was driving Matt crazy because I kept wanting to stop and take pictures. And he was like, we're not gonna stop every 30 seconds to take a picture. So anyways, um, this mug's super cute. When I took this picture, I was up really high elevation and it's another sunrise picture in Sedona, and it's incredible. Once you're just sitting there waiting for the sun to rise, you start noticing all kinds of things. And this one in particular, there were a ton of hot air balloons of people who rented hot air balloons to see the sunrise. It was so cool. So that's what inspired me for this mug. So it's got the sunrise picture, and it says Wanderlust on it. And it's got this adorable hot air balloon on it. You can see right here, those are actually hot air balloons in the picture too. But I wanted to reiterate how fun that was and it kind of takes me back to that morning. It was just a really, really special thing. And it's something you don't experience all the time. And so I made it a little mug. This one was done in Sedona. So, super cute. This is my personal favorite. Now here's another one. This is another Sedona image. So these are these awesome rocks and cliffs that are up, up high. You, it, you gotta go on this crazy dirt road. There's this tiny little parking lot. It's kind of crazy, but it's really beautiful. Once you get up there, there's just views for days. And it's just really fun. So this one has a little compass with some arrows that says find your own way. I thought it was a really cool graphic. It fit perfectly between those little um, cliffs, I guess you would call them. I don't know. Um, yeah, I don't know the technical term. I'm not that awesome. So, anyways, this is another one. This is interesting. So, this skyline, it was supposed to be completely blue, and it came out a little more purple. And that's kind of the beauty of my handmade products. I like it. Um that every time I print and press something, it's a little different. I try my hardest to get it almost exactly perfect, but sometimes, I don't know, it's kind of a Bob Ross thing where it's a happy accident in my mind. So anyways, so this one's super cute. Um, it says, find your own way. That's another mug on the Wild and Wonderful one. And then last but not least, this is another one. This picture is kind of cool. I thought it was neat with the sun coming through the trees. This is a sunset shot, and I got a nice starburst on that, which I thought was really cool. This one says, discover yourself, because you and I both know something happens when you're out in nature. Something comes over you, if you're lucky, I don't know. Like, I feel like I'm getting all crunchy granola on us. but. That's it. Like, you just can discover other things. I know Matt and I, when we, we don't really hike together very much. It's typically me, just with my camera. And we really learned a lot about each other, our relationship, and I'm actually kind of scared of heights. I learned that. But it's really neat that once you really get out in the wilderness alone, you start discovering other things about yourself. And I thought that was kind of cool. So anyways, these are the Wild and Wonderful mugs. They're really cute. Little mugs, aluminum, see? Really fun. So I just wanted to say hi. Trying to do a little more YouTube videos, so make sure you subscribe because I'm going to be doing more. I'm going to do other topics. I'm going to probably do some on business, maybe some on photography, maybe some on Etsy because I've gotten some feedback that you guys want to learn a little more about business and stuff like that. So, I mean, I'm not a pro, but I've been doing it for a hot minute, so I figured why not. So anyways, thanks for watching. I will talk to you guys later, okay? Bye.